Hello, fellow gamers. Welcome back to the Veteran Game Channel. Today, we're going to deep dive into the mesmerizing world of Invector, Rhythm Galaxy. Just a heads up, there's no need for seatbelts because the ride is going to be smooth but blisteringly fast. Let's dive in. Right off the bat, I want to clear the air about the story element in the Invector series. By now, developers Hello Their Games should have figured out that the franchise doesn't need a campaign to justify its existence. Aviasi Invector gave us a slightly oddball narrative about a space pilot's chocolate quest, and now, with Rhythm Galaxy, the tradition continues. This time, we're tagging along with some teenage space pilots as they traverse multiple galaxies, playing cosmic hopscotch and blasting cool tunes. It's a narrative that feels as thrilling as a worn-out doormat, and soon enough, I found my finger hovering over the skip dialogue button, eager to get into the real meat of the game. Now, if you're familiar with the Invector series, you'd know that the actual gameplay is a space-age symphony of rhythmic button prompts. We've got our spacecraft riding along a cosmic pathway, with your task being to hit the button cues in time to accelerate. The difficulty levels juggle how many buttons you need to keep track of and the score threshold required to pass a level. However, brace yourselves, the leap from casual to normal can feel like you've been flung from a gentle hillside to Mount Everest. Yet, even the casual difficulty has its moments of rogue challenge, sprinkling unexpected twists now and then. But let's take a step back and appreciate the visual spectacle that is in Vector, Rhythm Galaxy. This game is a painting in motion, every pixel bursting with vibrant colors that create an incredible illusion of speeding through a technicolor cosmos. It's a visual treat that whizzes by, leaving a trail of awe and longing. Now, onto the star of the show's the soundtrack. Boasting 40 unique tracks ranging from the rock beats of royal blood to the timeless voice of Tina Turner, the game ensures your musical journey is far from monotonous. And hey, don't worry about your favorite track getting old. The single and multiplayer modes let you revisit your unlocked songs as often as you like. Add in the multiplayer challenges where you strive to top your friend's scores, and you've got a rhythmic fiesta that keeps the party going. The gameplay, my friends, is as smooth as butter. There's an immediate response to your inputs, and though a tad more rumble feedback could amplify the immersive experience, it doesn't take much away from the game. I played it on the Steam Deck, and let me tell you, it looks fantastic there, just as it does on PC. However, I have to be frank that the Invector series, though fun and exhilarating, is starting to feel like it's orbiting the same old star. If you're a franchise veteran, you might argue for the familiar, but even then, there's no denying that Rhythm Galaxy feels a lot like the previous games. You control your spacecraft, weave through floating rings, hit jumps and boosters, it's incredibly satisfying, yet echoes a sense of deja vu. One of the game's unique moments is racing to the classic beats of Tina Turner's The Best, a song that made waves way back in 1989. To wrap it up, and Vector, Rhythm Galaxy is a rhythm game that ticks all the boxes, great tracks, stunning visuals, and solid gameplay. But, the charm of familiarity is slowly wearing thin, and the attempt to inject an ill-fitting narrative doesn't help. The game is as beautiful as ever, but there's a need for innovation to keep the adrenaline flowing. Nonetheless, if you're a rhythm game enthusiast or an Invector fan, this game is a worthwhile experience. Till next time, keep the rhythm alive, and game on, folks.